Let me be your guide to English past, present, and future. My topic for my final project is the influence of God in American writing. I would like to focus on women's writings in particular moving through history from writers as early as Anne Bradstreet to as late as Maria Stewart. Although these women lived in very different time periods and in very different atmospheres, the positive and profound influence of their faith in God is clear in their writings. Their faith in God helped inspire each of them to write and added to their subject matter. They wrote about how their faith helped them deal with the tragic events in their lives, allowing them to take a philosophical view of the bad times in their lives. Their faith also backed up their ideas about gender and race equality and helped them make the arguments they needed to change the minds of others around them. The authors I have chosen to study are Anne Bradstreet, Phyllis Wheatley, and Maria Stewart. My project will begin with a short overview of the three authors, Bradstreet, Wheatley, and Stewart. My thesis will come next. My thesis statement, which is tentative, is although these women lived in different time periods, the profound influence of their faith in God is clear in their writings as they seek to use their faith to encourage others and to help change long-held attitudes in the world around them. Next, I will take an in-depth look at Anne Bradstreet and how her writings were influenced by her faith in God. She talks about the tragic deaths of some of her grandchildren and how her faith allowed her to withstand such tragic events. Next, I will look at Phyllis Wheatley, her writings, and how they were influenced by her faith. Her faith in God informs her arguments for race equality and gives her the courage and faith in herself to write about them. Lastly, I will look at Maria Stewart, her writings, and how they were influenced by her faith in God. She uses her faith to explain why she believes in gender and race equality and to convince the others around her. She uses her faith as a basis for her arguments. Next, I will compare and contrast the writer's views and the influences of their faith. In my conclusion, I will talk about how each of the writers represented women in America in the past and still do so today. As we look together at these three women writers, it will be fascinating to see how much their faith influenced them to write and how much their writing can be enjoyed and applied to our lives today. Our journey begins soon.